Hello, welcome to my very first Mac tutorial. Good morning, or good day, because I'm from Australia. Um, the Good Morning is from one of my favourite TV shows. Um, you might not have heard of it, but it's Hello, Hello, and that's an Englishman pretending to be French. Anyway, that's just silly. Um, this is my first Mac. Um, and it's working very well for me right now. I am a Windows Network Admin by trade, so I fix PCs or Windows all day long, and I got a bit sick of it, and I wanted something that worked, and it's always good to keep the brain working, and I've seen all the ads and everything, and I just got intrigued, and people were saying that Mac it just works, so I tried it, and it does. Um, the way I got into it, I looked on YouTube a lot, I found tutorials of Mac, and one of the main guys was Dragon Pimi, he's a very cool guy, and one of my friends, online friends, that is, um, he's a guy from England. I'm actually from England originally, now in Australia, I don't know what my accent sounds like, but anyway, he had a tutorial that tackled the issue of external hard disks, the ones you plug in via USB and so forth. Now the thing is, some of them you can't write to with a Mac. Um, I will show you now one that does. Now it's NTFS file system that doesn't let you do it. This is an older one. And it will pop up. Oh, by the way, this is the loop picture of me as a Simpsons character. That's kind of what I look like. That's popped up. Um, that's my disk. And I can right click. Right here. Actually Mac does have right click. Isn't that amazing? Some people say it doesn't. And that's a little thing you can just tag colors, labels, organize things a bit better. Um, I will drag this file into there, and that works. Drag it again, and it works. There you go, replace. It's in there. This is a FAT32 disk. There's the file. Drag that back to trash. Take it off. We can eject it. using a uh, right click which does exist on Mac. Now here is my 80 gigabyte naughty Windows hard disk um, which you can't write to. I won't bother showing you you can't write to it. I have in Windows actually renamed this disk to naughty because it's a naughty Windows disk and it won't let Mac in. You can copy files off it, um, but you can't write to it. Um, wrong cable, silly me. Plug it in. Now we need to format it as a FAT32, which Mac can do, and there we go, Mr. Naughty. Okay. If we go into Spotlight, this is where you can get all your applications here. Spotlight. Click, type in, ooh, silly disk. Okay, disk utility is there, or you can find it in Finder. Your applications. Yeah. Up there. That's. In the utilities folder, there's a disk utility. Okay, this will find two hard disks. This one here is your main operating system, which uh, Mac OS runs on. Don't do anything with that. That's that's bad. You'll lose your whole everything on your Mac. This one here is the naughty disk. Now, I'm going to erase this one. So, click on that erase and 
default it will go to Mac OS. If you want to, you can. If you don't ever touch a PC, but you probably do because you can have friends or work. You want to plug the p this drive in, and you want to be able to copy and paste and do all that stuff. So we check MS-DOS file system. Give it a title. Oops, 80 gigabyte. And now click on the erase. It will ask you, do you want to erase naughty? Yes, I do. Erase it. And now it is wiping that hard disk away. Wiping it away. I'm not quite sure how long that will take. So in the meantime, and by the way, I have backed up everything, so don't freak out. I will show you a trick. This is for Windows users who probably aren't so used to finding applications in Mac. You can get your applications on this is your main hard disk. The icon may look different. I'll customize that to look like my laptop, my MacBook. Uh, you can drag this and it won't go on here, this is like shortcuts to applications but to the right of this line, see the line there you can pop that in and if you right click it's just like a start menu right, you can access all your applications like that fairly easily Okay. Uh, what's going on here? it's still going Still going. I'm not quite sure how long it'll take to go. Oh, and it's done. Isn't that 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 was very quick. It's an 80 gig hard oh see the PC would not take that short time. It would be struggling away. And believe me, I've I've formatted enough PCs. <laughs> I know all about that. Anyway, um now we shall drag this. Open it up. You can see Rob's 80 gig is now empty. Drag the little man on, and there we are. That's a hard disk. Now I can plug into a PC and a Mac, and everything will be hunky dory. Um, I hope that tutorial was of some help, and have fun with your Mac. And if you don't have Mac, I suggest you get one. And this is coming from someone who works with Windows all day long. Have fun. Bye.